Welcome to This Is GAA, a podcast that concentrates on Ulster GAA football, with a big take on Ulster GAA club and county football teams in provincial and all Ireland competitions, and also my look at all the latest GAA news. The podcast is available in audio form on Amazon Music and Audible, and also on Spotify, and it's in video form on YouTube. So let's jump right in. Kerry McGinney's interview after the court match with Armagh TV. Uh, it will give us a few insights into his thinking uh, ahead of the Blue Ball final, league final uh, this Sunday in Cove Park. Kieran, a draw here in Parky Cueve. We'll get your thoughts. Still unbeaten after seven games in the league. Yeah, no, it was you know ups and downs. I thought we played really well in the first half, and we didn't do too bad in the second half. Maybe we ponder us on the ball, but. Um, Two back passes for two goals, and I would, would, wouldn't be happy with that. But listen, uh, they, re- they reacted well to both of them. In fairness, it's um, like you know, give a team the cork, like those sort of chances are going to put them away. They're very strong on the counter, a really good, strong running team. Um, it was disappointing to give those goals away, like you know, we haven't given any all year. So, like, to, I suppose to set the team up for two, like, it's a bit disappointing. But you know, it's just, um, but as I said, they did very well to come back and, and get a draw out of it. And is that probably the most frustrating thing coming away from you here in them two goals? Because I know the defensive record has been rock solid the whole way through the campaign. Yeah, no, but at least I know that it's something that they can, you know, they can fix. You, know, you, you just can't go to sleep with those types of hand passes. So, uh, but you know, you have to look at the other side of it. Like to make six points up is, is a good like indicator of their their fight and their willingness to push on. And like, you know, getting TK in there today too. Like, in, like you know, a full seventy minutes on those bad we ain't got a half too. So. You know, it's a lot of a lot of positives out of it as well. And uh, talking about goals, Peter McGrain, another goal. Was there as many cornerbacks good as many goals during your days? <laughs> Our cornerbacks weren't allowed to kick the ball at the goals. Uh, no, it, look, it's uh, Peter's a good lad. Like you know, Jeff and Ashton have had a great league for us this year, and hope it continues into the championship. And Rui Grugan as well. Kian has been rock solid for you throughout the whole campaign. I think he got one three the day, set up um, a, a great pass for the first goal um, with Joe McElroy and set up the. the score at the end for Ashton Connolly he's been a, a huge player for you for a decade or more now probably yeah like, always first class like, there's there's very little superlatives that you can use from like, like, well I haven't used I, I think he's he probably doesn't get the recognition he deserves but um, uh, like he was, he was asked to finish was sublime like there's, there's very few boys can finish from that tight of an angle like so uh, very composed on that so I yeah, know like but um, he's he puts in the work and he puts in the time like you know he's he's very skillful but like he's a great worker for us as well so no no just definitely he's had a great league but like, for these boys now it's about pushing on and we have another big game next week another game two weeks after that so they're coming thick and fast and Ken, I suppose, how, how would you sum up the league as a whole? Because I know it's not finished yet. You, you have a league final next week, but of the, the seven games, how would you sum it all up? Yeah, no, look, no, we're unbeaten. Um, and that, that's pretty good like, for us. Uh, but you know, going into the league final now, like, it, it's, it's just like everything steps up a, a gear. And again, like a great reminder for us today, just in case people like, you know, from Anna, like, Again, like you know, show the true worth. You know, bounce back out there with a win today. And the only thing they'll have in their mind is three weeks is us, and it's going to be like you know, a hell of a battle up there. And that's that's all we can focus on. No, no more more than that. And just a league final, Kieran. Obviously, Silver were on the line a big day out in Croke Park. Like this is a huge game for for our players and management and fans as well. Yeah, no. Listen, now you get to Dublin. It's a good one. So um, yeah, everybody will be looking forward to it. You know, but it's like the league finals are good for the day, and then. Monday morning is all back to, to porridge again.